Welcome Leos, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Happy to be here with y'all. So, let's see what's coming towards you. Okay, this is a timeless reading, so whenever you're meant to see this is when you're simply meant to see this reading, okay? This energies can be vice versa. This could be you or a partner, okay? It could be someone around you. It's energy that's lingering around. It could be a cross watcher's energy, okay? So take what applies and leave the rest. If this message resonates with you, okay, you can book the extended version. That information will be in the drop box below. And if you just want to simply just purchase a reading with me, your very own personal reading, that information will be in the drop box the drop box below as well all right so let's do this let's see what we have for leos i need an overall energy please for leos all right so i have the devil in reverse and the seven of wands some of you can be dealing with a capricorn we have the devil in reverse, which is Capricorn's energy, and the Seven of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy. King of Cups here. Oh, the Two of Cups. Oh, okay, so you're you're okay. Okay, we got the King of Cups and the Queen of Cups, but then we got the Seven of Wands. I'm sorry, this Queen of Wands here that's in the background out of all of this, in the back of all of this. What's going on here? What's going what's going on here? Because I have the King of Cups and the Queen of Cups and then someone working and building on a relationship here. The King of Cups and the Queen of Cups is very loving, caring energy. Okay, these are two people who know how to express their emotions like an like an adult, you know, and they pretty much are very emotionally attached, okay? They're very sensitive and caring and loving. And then I have them cooperating, working together to build something here, building a relationship here. Okay. But I'm sensing that there is like this queen of wands here in the background here. But the thing of it is, is she's in the reverse. Okay. So the queen of wands in reverse is my other woman card. Okay. So there could be someone lingering in the background, okay? I feel like you're trying to find out here. You're doing some searching, okay, to see if someone's running back, okay, to someone, okay? I feel like you've been putting in a lot of effort. You've been putting in a lot of work, okay? And that's why I feel like the Seven of Wands is here because this is something that you've been fighting for. Um, and I feel like the situation could possibly be a toxic situation okay there could be like some addictions or codependency here okay let's see give me one more card all right we got the chariot future energy here okay well this is all past energy okay so Someone is making you feel like you have to keep your guard up. I got Capricorn here with the Knight of Pentacles. And we got Queen of Pentacles here too. So definitely Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. I'm getting a lot of Pentacles here. Six of Pentacles and the Nine of Wands. This is letting me know that you have gotten your, your, your guard is up, okay? Your guard is up, okay? Maybe you've been giving freely to someone, okay? And now... You feel like, okay, hold on. Let me put my guard up a little bit. I see lots of pentacles here, okay? Someone is financially possibly unstable here, okay? And they move, their, they take their time to make decisions. They just, you know, move along slowly, 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 slowly. And I feel like there could also be some type of drama. There could also be some type of defeat or conflict, okay? Someone's regretting a relationship here. We got the King of Wands in reverse, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Ten of Cups in reverse, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Five of Cups. Someone's regretting some action that they took, okay, and causing this relationship to be kind of imbalanced emotionally.
Give me present energy for Leo. We got Queen of Swords, Hangman, and we have the Nine of Swords in reverse, okay? We got the Three of Swords. Someone separated here. There's a separation here. We got the Four of Swords and the Three of Swords. Someone is definitely separated, so maybe you could be separated from this person, um, but there is, I feel like there's a separation here. Three of Swords. There could possibly be a third party involved. I feel like you're watching someone. You're keeping an eye on someone, okay? Page of Swords reverse. I feel like there is a marriage here. We got the Ten of Swords, the Lovers, and the Hierophant. The Hierophant being in reverse. Could be dealing with a Taurus, okay? But these two cards symbolize that there could possibly be like a separation or a divorce. And the Lovers is upside down, okay? It's in the reverse. So something just turned sour here is what I'm getting, okay? Maybe there was a third party involved, okay? I feel like you're waiting to see if someone's going to cut someone off. We got the Queen of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, but we see she comes to get the truth, okay? She comes to get the truth, all right? And she will get she will come at your throat hangman is when things are in the air and then the nine of swords in reverse i feel like you know there's some issues here that are going on that's kind of gotten you worried why is the queen of swords here six of wands okay okay so the truth comes to light someone's afraid okay someone's afraid to tell the truth okay but someone's getting some attention here from someone. Why is the Six of Wands here? Six of Wands. Ooh. Okay, the Chariot card. Cancer. Okay. So your intuition is telling you to move forward with something. Okay. Your intuition is telling you... That if you move forward, you'll gain some type of success in this, okay? But you don't have any control over, is it a King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn? King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Two of Cups, Pisces is energy. Four of Wands, Two of Pentacles. Okay, this is about whether or not if someone is still married here. High Priestess is Pisces' energy, but this could also be about secrets, things that are hidden. Your intuition is telling you that you don't have any control over this person, of what this person does, how this person moves, what this person does. Do, think, whatever the case may be. But I feel like I'm getting husband energy here with this King of Cups and this Four of Wands, okay? This is husband energy. You could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio. Two of Cups, okay? This is about someone still being in a relationship, okay? And juggling two, two people, two or more people, okay? So it's like, I feel like you may feel like you don't have any control over the situation. Why is the hangman here? The devil in reverse. Definitely a lot of you guys are dealing with Capricorn. Um... But you're waiting to see if this person is going to fight and try to get you back. You may lose hope, okay? Some of you guys are dealing with an Aquarius or a Libra. Um, but you feel like this situation is, you know, not done, okay? You may feel like this situation isn't over. So you're waiting this out to see if they're going to fight for you. If they're going to try to get you back or run back to you, okay? But the situation is imbalanced. Okay, but uh, but you feel I feel like you feel like there's unfinished business. Someone made some type of agreement or made some type of promise. Okay, hmm. Nine of Swords in reverse. And justice in reverse. 
Okay, so someone's here worried about karma. Someone's waiting to expose someone and someone starts cheating or lying. Okay, what's going on here? This could be over the internet, okay? Waiting for something that's in the dark to come to the light that someone started lying or being manipulative or cheating. Okay, so why is justice in reverse here? This is a karmic situation, I feel like. Page of Cups, you could be dealing with the Pisces. It's in the reverse. So, oh, look at the Five of Swords in the reverse. Ooh. Knight of Pentacles again, a Capricorn energy. Okay. Someone here is listening to someone's family. Four of Wands and the Nine of Wands and the Knight of Pentacles. Maybe you feel like you should have listened to someone's family about this person, what somebody's family told you. Or what your mom told you or something to that nature. Maybe you feel like you should have listened. Because now I feel like there is complete uh, something that needs to be balanced, okay? This could even have something to do with the court system, okay? But I feel like there's, with this five of swords in the reverse, that there could be some type of trouble or disagreements, okay? Why is the five of swords here? Somebody talking sideways. Yeah, the tower, okay? So... Strength card, Seven of Swords. Maybe you find out that this person told you a lie. And you may feel like this person does not care about you the way that they're portrayed. Okay? Because from what you can see, that they're a liar. And they're separated. King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus. Someone is definitely dealing with their earth sign. Okay? And there's something here about a separation. Okay? There's something here about a separation. Why is the tower here? Something out of the blue happens, okay? This is a little bit of drama. Wheel of Fortune. Something did not go in your favor. And I'm telling you, I feel like you feel like I should have listened to my family. I should have listened to what they tried to tell me. You got to be careful here. But I am keep feeling like you feel like something isn't over, Okay. You feel like something isn't over. Let's see if we can get you some advice, Leos. What message do you have for Leos? Okay, you got to trust your path. If you knew you would be supported, what would you do? What would you do if you knew you would be supported on this path that you're trying to take? Okay, it may be time for some of you guys to take a break. Okay, a life's work, not a season. Get off the treadmill. Okay, some of you are longing for a place of belonging. Okay, some of you guys are longing to belong or fit in with a certain group of people. Okay. Or, you know, just longing for that place of, you know, oh, this is where I belong. This is this is what I have going on. This is what I can do. Okay. I feel like <laughs> I feel like you guys need to take a step back. Okay. Take a step back and, and look at the situation from all angles here. All right. So if you want to book the extended version to see how this person feels, I'm getting ready to go um, into that. All right, you can book the extended. The information is in the drop box below. All right, if you want to book your very own personal reading with the Empress, that information is below as well. All right, my loves, subscribe, like, comment, share with your family and your friends. Until next time.